brain tech here, where tech is made simple. With the rollout and release of Google Chrome version 101, which is the latest stable version, and I did mention this in a video I posted on version 101, Google has started trials for a new advertising system called Topics and Fledge, um, which according to Google they say apparently uh, will give you a more private and personalized ad experience in the Google Chrome web browser. Now according to DuckDuckGo, they disagree. And as many of you know, DuckDuckGo is a privacy um, alternative to uh, the Google search um, for desktop. And also you can also download and install the browser for your mobile device. Now, according to DuckDuckGo, um, recently they say that their extension called DuckDuckGo Privacy Essentials, and as many of you know, this helps safeguard your browsing experience um, in Google Chrome. They say that the, ex the extension has now been updated uh, to block Google's topics and fledge, which started to be tested in version 101 of Google Chrome. Now, according to DuckDuckGo in a recent uh, blog post, and I'm going to quote this as it will just give you a wider and broader perspective of what is actually going on here. They say, and I quote, if, you, if you're a Google Chrome user, you might be surprised to learn that you may soon be automatically entered into Google's new tracking and ad targeting methods called Topics and Fledge. Topics uses your Chrome browsing history to automatically collect information about your interests to share with other businesses, tracking companies, and websites without your knowledge. Fledge enables your Chrome browser to target you with ads based on your browsing history. Um, and Dr. Go carries on to say, these new methods enable creepy advertising and other content targeting without third-party cookies. While Google is positioning this as more privacy respecting, the simple fact is tracking, targeting, and profiling, <laughs> according to Dr. Go, still is tracking, targeting, and profiling, no matter what you want to call it. And that's according to Dr. Go, how they feel about the new topics and fledge. Uh, that Google has now implemented in the Google Chrome web browser. Now, they do give some tips uh, if you are concerned about your privacy. And they say that um, the first one is um, don't, don't use Google Chrome as your web browser. Use a, another alternative. Uh, the next um, uh, tip they give is to, if you are using Chrome, is to download and install the DuckDuckGo a Chrome uh, extension, which is DuckDuckGo Privacy Essentials. And as mentioned, this has been updated and upgraded now recently to block um, the topics and fledge uh, in the Chrome web browser. And then the third tip they give is regarding your Chrome settings and some settings you can change in the browser and uh, your Google account settings. Now, the first they say is to uh, disable the privacy sandbox trial which I have covered in a previous video but how you do this is in Chrome you head to your uh, menu in the top right go to settings privacy and security and yeah you'll see privacy sandbox and what you can do is you can just disable privacy sandbox trials and then re uh, um, regarding your Google account uh, they say you can disable web and app activity and disable ad personalization. And to do this, you just head online to your Google account, uh, head to data and privacy. And yeah, you will see you can uh, disable web and app activity. You can turn that off. And the next thing they suggest is to disable and turn off ad personalization in your Google account settings under data and privacy for your Google account. So that's according to DuckDuckGo. And what they are suggesting now uh, regarding uh, the new topics and fledge with uh, that release of uh, Google Chrome version 101 with some tips that you can try and use if you are concerned regarding your privacy. So thanks for watching and I will see you in the next one.